everyone. We're here at the library again um, celebrating with you today World Bee Day and we wanted to give a little bit more information about our observational hives here. Um, today I'm joined by Stetson Owen. He's the operational manager at Be Well Honey and he's going to tell us a little bit more about honeybees and our hives and everything that we can do to help the bees. Well thank you very much and uh, like she said I work for Be Well Honey Farm. Uh, it's a family business. We've been around about 23 years now and it's something that my father was very passionate about and in 2013 Savannah Bee Company started the Bee Calls Project and so we always said that if it ever came to our county that we would always want to supply equipment and the bees for the students and for educational purposes and so that's what we've done here at the Easley location, the Pickens location, the Liberty location and also the Central location. We've installed these bees a few weeks ago as you can tell they're doing great. Um, they've been keeping a really good feeding regimen with them with the sugar water. They're really taken to the observation hive but what they're for is, is for the kids to be able to learn about the innovative ways that the beekeeping helps outside the classroom with pollination, flowers, their STEM learning mm -hmm. and so that's what we've been a part of and we've been really really grateful to be able to be the people that can give the bees to them. Well, I know that we are educating people um, and that's really important, but what can our friends at home do to help the bees just in their everyday lives? <laughs> they can always plant really good pollinator gardens. If you go online or go to your local garden center, they can tell you what really helps with honeybees that can Honeybees are more important outside the classroom with flowers and pollination. It helps with the seasons, the processes of growing food, and it's just really important to understand that side of the education and that's what I think we've done here. What would be the coolest things for our friends to come and check out when they come in to see the bees? Can you point out a couple awesome things? Uh, well, you can see right here how they're starting to form their wax for the honey and the honey's already being filled up at different levels. You can see all the bees right here working close together around these honey cells. All these hexagon shapes are going to be the exact same size. Mm. And you can tell there's different levels of variance in size across the board right here. But you can tell they're starting to store up for winter right here with some capped honey. And all the worker bees look about the same, but there's a big queen in here somewhere. We haven't spotted her today, but um, you'll be able to see her out laying eggs. And hopefully by a couple weeks from now, this will all be full and it'll be a thriving hive. That's awesome. Well, Stetson, we're so excited to have the bees here. We're so excited to have Be Well Honey Farm as our partner. Um, and we can't wait for you guys to come into the library to see the bees. Remember, if you come into the library, any branch uh, this week to see your bees, you'll make sure, make sure to get a C uh, CRB sticker and make sure you put your name in the drawing for our um, giveaway this week. We hope to see you soon. And don't forget, come see your bees. Thanks, guys. Thank you.